Welcome back to the Tyrac Expert Film Session. This week I wanted to take a look at Jake Butt, the talented tight end from Michigan who really had a career day last week at 6'6", 250 pounds, four catches, over 100 yards, earned himself the Mackey Tight End of the Week. Let me show you a couple of reasons why. But at the bottom of the screen, first thing he's got to do is be able to secure this defensive lineman. He does that. Now he's got to come up to the second level. If we hold it right here, one of the things you're going to see is that linebacker is going to see the run. Now he's going to try to run underneath the block. But he does a really good job of repositioning his feet and really taking the defender where he wants to go. If we take it back just a little bit, you'll see exactly what I mean. He's stepping outside. He tries to come underneath. He does a good job of moving his feet and, again, allowing the running back to get outside and get that positive yardage. Run blocking is important, but this is the versatility that he has. Now notice where he is. He's in the backfield as a fullback. His responsibility is going to be making sure he cuts down the end man on the line of scrimmage. Now look at the job he's going to do here, cutting that outside leg. He's cutting that outside leg. Why? Because the back is trying to get to the outside again. Does a good job of throwing. The defender is off balance. The back's able to get up the field. Does a good job of picking up the first down. Pass blocking is also going to be a vital part of playing the tight end position. Let's take a look at him again at the bottom of the screen. He's got a defensive end on him. Look at the position. Good job, hands inside, continue to fight, 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 continues to keep him at bay. Now he's trying to spin off of him, reposition himself. Now he's in a scramble drill. He understands that his quarterback's in trouble. Now he wants to leak out into the route to try to make a play. What every tight end wants to do, route running. Now we look at the route running here. This is important, guys. When you talk about the tight end, now you don't know the way he's aligned right now, whether he's running a route, whether it's a run play, you have no idea because he's lining up the same way all the time. Now you watch him come off the ball. If we can take it back just a little bit. I'll show you why it's important. This linebacker now reacts to that run. He's up the field. They want to throw it right behind his ear. So Butt knows he's got a look, does a good job. Now split him, gets up the field. Now, now Jake, don't make me pull out the siren. Please score, please score. I'm telling you, this guy at 6'6", 250, is gonna be a matchup nightmare. So Jake's at the top of the screen right now. He's gonna be trying to run a corner route, but he's gotta be able to read this safety right here to really understand exactly what he needs to do because there's some adjustments he has to make. Does a good job of getting a free release, balls in the air. We stop it right here. I'm going to show you what I mentioned about the adjustments. Normally, you see a corner, he wants to take it high. But because of the position of this safety here, he knows that he needs to bring this flat so he can bring it away from the defender. Does a good job. Now watch him attack, it with, attack the ball with his hands, then pulls it down and protects the ball. Jake Butt is becoming one of those elite tight ends in the country. And versus Indiana today, look for him running the scene routes down the middle of the field because that's where he should be open. Back to you, Dave.